I'm feeling good. I mean, I'm really excited. I think Adam gave me a really challenging song. Um, I like the choices that he's made with it stylistically, and it's, it's a big challenge. I'm nervous, I'm excited, all at one time. I mean, I, I can't wait to get up there and do it, but I'm also like completely nervous about doing something that's such a departure from all the stuff I've done up to this point. So nervous, excited, all those things. I think you are. I think we're doing a song that's a bit of a departure stylistically, and I do feel like people are kind of asking for a specific thing based on the songs I've done up to this point, and we're doing something a little different. So I'm curious to see how it's going to be received. I mean, I, I need to be challenged. I think the minute you stop doing something that's difficult and uncomfortable, and you might as well just stop doing what you're doing. So this is good for me, but I hope that people respond to it. Well, Adam was just telling me, you know, do the song the way it was sung. Um, you know, the Adele comparison's been made a lot. <laughs> and I don't always get it, but I'm highly, highly flattered by it. But now that it's been made, I've got to run as far away from that as I can because, you know, I'm, I'm not Adele. You know, I'm not like the second Adele. I, I don't want to be a pale comparison of Adele. I want to be me. And I feel like Adam kind of sees who that is and is kind of taking me really far in another direction to prove that I can do more than just what's kind of expected of me. So to all my fans at home, especially my fans in Eastern North Carolina, I am so excited to be on the stage doing what I love and I'm so excited to feel your support. You've been behind me from the beginning. Um, no one growing up ever said, I couldn't do what I loved. Nobody ever discouraged me from pursuing my dreams. So I feel like you're right up there with me. And I really hope come Monday you like what you see and you vote, please. <laughs>